Hello and welcome to Keep Collective. My name is Lauren and I'm going to be your independent designer. In case you have never heard of Keep, I wanted to put together a little video to help get you started. First, you will start by choosing a keeper. A keeper is basically the base part of your jewelry. We'll start with a leather band. This is a single leather band, reversible. And that's what it looks like. Next, there are the double leather bands. They wrap around twice. If you notice, they have two different colors. All of the leather bands are reversible. There are many different colors to choose from. Brand new, three brand new pastels that you can go check out online. You can see all the colors there. Next, there are the mesh bracelets. I think these might be my favorite. They come in silver, gold, and rose gold. Obviously, this is a silver. Each mesh band comes with three stoppers, and these stoppers slide up and down. You can put your key in the middle of them, and it won't slide around. I also have bangles, but I do not have one to show you. And then we have the pendants, and I'm wearing one as well. So the pendants, in pictures, they look huge. I didn't like it, but um, when I got it, I love it, love, love, love it. Probably my favorite in person. It comes with one little stopper. So once you've picked out your keeper, which is your base piece, you move on and choose a key. Tons of things to choose from. You can choose a little timepiece, which is just basically a watch. You can put this on everything, anything. I have seen necklaces with a timepiece on it. There are script bars that have little sayings that says, live happy. Um, with the script bars, if you notice they have a curve to them, if you do get a bangle, the bangle at the top is straight. Technically, they do not fit. I have seen where people bend them, but I'm not going to suggest it. But it'll fit on everything else. Then, uh, tons of symbols. Tiger Paul. There's a script word. Several script, script words. Um, we have little birthstones. And there's also stones. Right here in front of me. There you go. Um, I also want to show you something real quick before I show you how to put them on the, the bands. These keys, the stones especially, you can put on a chain and wear them as a necklace by themselves. And I don't know if you can see the, the groove in them, but they just slide right on the band. So, there you go. I know many people have, have wanted to know how the keys work. That's how it works. Go on easy just like that. So once you've picked out everything, you have created your own custom piece of jewelry to you, custom to you. If you have any questions or need help with anything, please let me know. I'm here to help you. Thank you.